Hey, welcome to another episode of What's Up in Photography. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Liquify tool, uh, a tool that I use in quite a few of my portrait sessions. Just There are times when you just need to liquefy somebody a little bit. You don't want it to be extreme. Uh, the example I'm going to show today is extreme. So you can see here I've actually just I've made another layer called After. I just tried this before I actually recorded the video. Uh, just to show you the before and after effects of using the liquify tool. So the first thing we're going to do is go to filter, liquify. These are some of the standard settings I'd like to use. I'd like to use a big brush at around 200, a brush density of about 50, and pressure at about 55. And then I slowly start pushing in, uh, in this case the stomach, uh, but I don't do it too extreme. I just push it in ever so slightly and I keep working at the process so we don't get distortions in the skin. Um, again, I'm doing this as a very quick demonstration. In a product I was going to sell to a client, I would actually make it a lot more cleaner, slower, um, and I always duplicate the layer before I actually do anything. So that way if I don't like it, I can always throw the layer away too as well. So here I'm actually just slowly pushing in the stomach to to basically bring it to a little bit more of a flat type image like we have on the right uh, with the, the look-alike uh, with a little bit more of a flatter tone stomach and you can see I'm just slowly bringing this in this is very very helpful when you're photographing clients that wear short sleeves and you just need to tuck in a little bit uh, it's it's very very handy for gentlemen who have love handles and maybe are wearing a dress shirt you just need to pull stuff in a little bit. 